wants to go to Chicago. What's up guys? My lift is actually here right now, so I gotta go, but I'll be back. LAX traffic, mm -hmm. nothing better. Yeah, so I'm currently at LAX. My flight takes off in exactly one hour. I'm actually doing this uh, trip solo, but in theory, I'm not doing the trip solo because you guys are coming with me. I'd want to go to Chicago with me. Right? Proud of LAX for this one. Way to go, Lax. Thank you very much. So this will be my first time in Chicago. Love being able to go to new places because that's what traveling is all about, right? Three guys in the back of a plane. Here we go. about this back in Chicago, mercy, mercy me, that mercy you lies. This is the cut out coffee. It's making me bloated, staining my teeth. You know, I'm doing the Invisalign as well, so not helping. Right now I just got a green tea uh, latte with coconut milk. Hi, how are you? Oh, it's nice and cold in here. Happy to be here for the first time, but happier to be here with you guys. Let's have some fun. The Trump building. Where's Ferris Bueller at? What are you doing? Oh yeah. Ooh, how quaint. Oh man, I remember waking up this morning being like, I just slept for like a minute. I just want to sleep for another five hours. Two hours later. I think tonight I'm just kind of laying low. I might go pop over to this London house bar. I don't know, there's something about the organic process of making friends and just being in a new place, in a new setting, that I think not only helps you grow, but it, it molds you. I don't want to use the same words, but it just turns you into somebody that sometimes maybe you don't know you could be. You know, the energy you give off, I think other people kind of see that immediately, and I'm learning that now as I'm kind of traveling more, is that, you know, people kind of feel your energy from the get-go. You know, I think being alone in those situations really helps you figure out more about yourself, but more about the other people around you as well, if you're around anybody else, just, just going and throwing yourself into a, you know, a, a scene or some type of environment where uh, you're socializing. Any ladies need some entertainment tonight? I'm just gonna take the opportunity to go over there and just uh, not even get a drink. I'll probably just get like, you know, fucking seltzer with lime or something. How much just for a plain cranberry juice? And then uh, come back here, definitely get some sleep, and then tomorrow's a big day. One minute, 37 seconds later. <laughs> 7.59 a.m. I didn't get so much sleep last night. Um, I guess I didn't, this air conditioning in here was like blasting. But I woke up and of course, like my throat, I don't know if it's like, it's like when you swallow it hurts a little bit, so yeah. I'm dealing with that today, but uh, not stopping me from seeing Chicago, Chicago. <laughs> I'm looking forward to meeting you guys today. Also get into this Manchester City game. I'm going to uh, get ready. Go get some tea, because that's the number one thing I need. One hour later. Right. Thank you, man. Thank you. This is like this show called Chicago Fire. Is this show, what's this show called? It's a show? Chicago Fire. It's like a... Uh, TV show. TV on, show? On NBC. On NBC. Appreciate it. Thank you, bro. You're welcome. Have a nice day, man. Thank you too. It's raining right now. I'm at Millennium Park. It's like something out of Men in Black. It's like the perfect music for it raining right now. If you think about composers back in the day, like they're up there controlling an orchestra, controlling music. If you think about where it started to where it is now, wow. No electronics. Nothing. No computers, no Serato, just instruments and hand movements and people who know how to play. The first DJ will always live on. So shout out to you, Mr. Composer. Shout out to good music. 
Shout out to real music. Chicago, Chicago, she is. I will show you around. And that is the Bean, aka the Cloud Gate, aka don't call it the Bean because it's called the Cloud Gate. That's what I was just told. So I'm sticking with it. Other than being out here to sightsee and be here for the first time, I'm also out here to go to a soccer game. Manchester City is here playing Dortmund. I think that's how you say it. Dart Dartmouth? Dortmund. I was way off. But it's like a certain type of European Champions Cup. They're having it here at Soldier Field in Chicago. So I was invited by Manchester City to come out, uh, attend the event. So that is what I'm doing. Honestly, it's crazy how much tea works because I feel better already. Stop, man. Why do you always come and kill the vibe with those things? Oh, man. But, um, yeah. Where are you guys from? What are you doing here? You're in camp? Uh, we're from Kids Play Camp. Kids Play, what were you doing? You're hanging out? We were at a party and then all of a sudden it started raining. You guys will be in my vlog. Vlog, yeah. yeah! You guys are awesome. Well, hold on, give me more, give me more, give me more, give me more, give me more. I love kids, man. Now everybody's looking at me. Embarrassed! Hi! This is my daughter, Jasmine. 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 Hi, Jasmine. Of course, of course. Say what's up. What's up? What's up? It's okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hi, Red subscribers! You guys are great. High five. It was nice to meet you guys. You. Good luck and everything, okay? Thank you. Yeah, what's up, man? Right? Yeah, for sure. Thank you so much. Nice to meet you guys. <laughs> What's your name? Nina, Caroline. Where are you guys from? Chicago. Yeah. Chicago. Georgia. We're tourists for the day, you know? Tourists for the day. Yeah. State your name, gangster. I'm Val the Vegan Gal. <laughs> I'm sure. Oh, look at my shoes. Thank like you. I wore it because uh, I know you're a Nirvana fan. Oh, I love it. And them. you told me you're vegan. Of course. <laughs> and state your name, gangster. Aaron. Aaron, here for Brett, of course. You're so awesome. <laughs> Karen. Hi. Go, yeah, come closer, scooch in. Did you go to the vegan place like two weeks ago here? I, I had one and I missed it. I wore a beanie because we're at the beans, so I was like, fuck it. Come on, come on. Come on. Like, that's not who I think it How is. How are you? Give me a hug. Oh my gosh. Hi. How are you guys? Sophia. Sophia. And Emily. Yeah. Can we take sure. a picture? Are you going to be in my vlog? Is that okay? Oh my god, that's going to be cool. It's nice to meet you guys. One, two, three. One, two, three. Have fun, guys. Chicago, Chicago, I will show you around. So I just came to, where are we at? Native? Uh, Native Foods. And Chicago. Cynthia said she saw my tweet. Yes, I saw it. I was going to go, but I couldn't. I'm happy I'll be able to go see you. Yeah, 100% right now. Right. Well, what's it? You're going to be my vlog. Okay? Yes. All right. All right, let's take a picture for sure. Later that same evening. Later. Chicago, Chicago, that town in town. Chicago, Chicago, I will show you around. You're rocking it right now. Ooh. 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 Sorry, come on, come on. I'm Hurry sorry. Up, Tell my vlog who you are then. Who am I? Yes. Who am I? Mm -hmm. So well. I kind of do social media for Man City. I do a bit of presenting as well. I follow the team everywhere across the world. I'm so lucky I've got an amazing job. And you're really cool. Yeah, and I get to meet guys like you, so. Oh, <laughs> look at that. Chicago, Chicago. Oh yeah, I look like somebody. So that was fun. You know, Manchester City loses 0 1. 
six and a half hours later. It's seven in the morning, Saturday, and I'm back at the airport. Wow, what a cool city. Definitely wish I had more time there. Currently on my way to uh, my gate, getting on a plane, and I'm going to Scottsdale, Arizona. I am tired today. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Appreciate it. Thank you. It is a hot one out here. I'm hanging out with some friends today. It's just a bachelor party. I'm catching them on the last day. I am in no mood to drink. One hour later. So this is the reason why I came out to Phoenix today. It's this guy's bachelor party. How long have we known each other? Hebrew school? 20 years. Congratulations. Thank you. Love you, bro. Early the next morning. It's 5.36 a.m. right now. Sunday morning. I'm on my way back to L.A. It has been a long trip. I cannot wait to get back and just get some sleep. But uh, I hope you guys enjoyed everything. Enjoyed this vlog. And thank you for tagging along with me for this trip. And until our next trip together, my name is Brickhead. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Los Angeles. Like, oh, finally. I've done it. I've reached the point in my life. I've seen a cactus. Oh, I can go like home now.